Okay, hey guys. If I got this. Every time people come by, they want to use my computer, they don't realize it's not just a computer, it's a tripod, man. There, goddammit. Keep your fucking hands off my computer's tri keyboard, man. What the fuck, you know? Well, it works setting that baby up. <laughs> hey, dudes. Must be all these six hour power shots, man. Whoa. I seen Jenna Marbles, man. She got drinking coffee or some shit one day. Maybe she was drinking a memory drinks. But anyway, um,. I don't want to get off on that too much, but, you know, I heard, uh, like, Ann Romney, the wife of Nick Romney, Mick Romney, Sick Romney, whatever you want to call him, Rom Nutlessly, you know, Rom Nutless, you know, uh, to complaining and, oh, I had five boys to raise, you know. Five boys, she raised five boys on a millionaire's salary, you know. Five boys on a millionaire's salary. She didn't even have to work, man, you know. I know chicks out there that got three, two, three, four kids that got to work, for Christ's sakes. And take care of the kids. And they don't have a fucking million dollars, man, you know, to go hire a goddamn butler or hire all goddamn take. Joe Blow takes uh, my kids cleaning laundry over to the cleaners, you know. No, the person that's working got a couple kids working trying to make ends meet. She's got to clean her own clothes, man. You know, yeah, you tell me how hard it is raising five boys when you got a goddamn $300,000 goddamn horse in the Olympics, man. When the hell did you get time to do that, huh? I thought you were raising five boys, man. I'm going Obama, man. For what it's worth, I'm endorsing Obama. And that's basically, this is my political viewpoint of everything. This is where I stand, you know. Here, congressmen talk about it, newscasters, everybody else give their two cents about who they want to be president. This is why I want Obama to be president, man, you know. We may be sure, we haven't gone maybe ahead the way we should have gone, but Christ, we just come out of a war. We had lost how many thousands of people in New York with them goddamn Twin Towers being attacked, let alone the Pentagon, Pentagon God, that got attacked, and the innocent people that crashed the plane right in the ground, man. You know? Man, there was a lot of people died. That costs a lot of money, man. You, when you have a war, you don't get that back, you know. We never got no oil out of there. We're supposed to pay for it with oil, man. You know, I didn't see we get any oil or cheaper oil. Price of oil's gone up ever since we've been in that damn war, you know. But anyway, get back to Nick Romney, man. Obama said he was going to get Ben Laden. He got him, man. He did a lot of things. He said he's, he got health care passed. Christ, you know. Don't take effect for a couple more years, but... That's why the Republicans are pissed at him, man. Republicans could never get a goddamn health care program passed, you know. Gerald Ford, I think he was the closest one to come along to get a health care program even talked about, man, you know. National health care. Wow, finally. But anyway, just a few things I want to talk about, man. Because, I mean, sure, I didn't make any money. I just got down on Facebook bitching about they're charging me buck a word or something like that. And I got to pay for plates on my car that I didn't even use last year. I didn't even have it registered. Put it on the road, you know. Why should I have to pay plates for a car I don't even put on the road? You know? How many times I pay sales tax on that thing? I paid sales tax. person before that paid sales tax. That car don't owe anybody years worth of goddamn license plate money, man. Then they want to charge me new rate, too. Fuck. Ah, I got to pay last year's rate at this year. And I don't get the tabs for last year. I get the ones for this year. I don't get any last year's paperwork. I mean, at least I could get that. I paid for the damn thing, you know. 
Holy shit. Then I was two days, a couple days late, a pawnbroker. He hit me up a couple more bucks, so. Yeah. But anyway, that's what I'm trying to say, man. This fucking money don't go any fucking place, man. You give us all this money, man. You know, seven bucks, eight bucks an hour minimum wage. Twenty six, twenty five thousand a year average, more average than the average middle class is like fifty thousand. That's not even real, man. That's a thousand bucks a week for Christ's sakes, you know. A lot of people don't make that. Some people do, but not a lot of them make it. A lot of people make minimum wage, man. So that's the difference. But we're still floating along, you know. We're still going. We finished up a couple wars. We're starting to get done with the other one. And got the terrorists. That costs a few bucks. All these, uh... Well, we've got about New Orleans, you know. That costs us how many billions? That We all got to take that out of the tax dollars, man. That, that tax dollars should have just been... If we hadn't had them storms, wars, and everything, look at the money we would have had, for Christ's sakes, man. Holy shit, no wonder we're broke. It's like we went out and blew all our money at the fucking casino last night, and we wonder why we're broke, you know. We gambled it all in world peace and tried to get New Orleans built back up, and then a flood hit us after that, and all the other countries around the world are rough shape too, you know. We're not the only one. You know, Europe, they're going to be bad pretty soon, too, you know. We don't get this thing turned around. It's going to go global, man. Holy shit, man. You won't have a country any place that you can go to that you can... The Me We'll be trying to get into Mexico, trying to get a better paying job than in the U.S., man. Think of it, man. You get that square-ass, punk-ass goddamn... Romley in there, because that's why I think he is, man. He looks like the goddamn neighborhood bully, man. No, you're going to listen to what I say when I say it, man. Even if you're the president, you can wait. I'm Nick Romley, you know, just a regular old guy, and here's the president. Oh, you can wait, president. Christ, Obama, you should get... Whoa. But he slammed him good, though, later on, man. He told him exactly the truth, man. Romley, we don't have that... We don't have as many horses and bayonets... Now, as we did during the year of uh, 1916, man, so pretty much tell where the Republicans had her at. Wasted all that time when the Republicans could have been getting some jobs created instead of blaming the president for not doing jobs creation. Why didn't them Republicans put out a goddamn bill every day, man, even though it gets voted down? Put out another one, man. No, we're all going to just put out one piece of paper this year. We'll sign it. No new taxes. That's going to be our job, man. Now we can just kick it around and go drink martinis all day and bullshit. Say how important our jobs is, man. Fuck it, man. Come on, get real, man. The American people know this shit, man. You're not fooling nothing, nobody. We know you're just fucking around in Washington. Christ, Mitch McConnell said it too, man. You know, main purpose is to make... Obama won term president. Why? You did that before he even fucking started, man. You didn't even give him a fucking chance, you know. Nobody gave him a chance, really, you know. We voted him in, yeah. But nobody really gave him a chance, you know. We had a pretty good vice president that could have taken over if he couldn't handle it. But So anyway, I'm endorsing Obama. Election, remember that? Get out, get off your ass, and get out there and vote. Thank you.